What's up, Assassin Nation? It is Assassin4259 here, and welcome back to more Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support on this game. It really and truly means a lot to me, especially when it's like my favorite game of all time. And, it's, that's, and that's none other than Assassin's Creed, so... <laughs> Thank you guys so much for everything. It really, really means a lot, and I'm just truly grateful to you guys every single day just for entertaining you guys and just the support just means a lot so thank you guys so much and with that being said leave a like for more assassin's creed 3 remastered if you guys want more parts quick and as always guys let's do this all right juno i know what you want me to do wonder what's inside only one way to find out and the controller begins once again. I'm sorry guys, I I keep running out of time to not fix it. Hang on. Where one door opens, I mean, where one door closes, another opens. Gosh, I screwed that up. I'm sorry. Whoop. Nice. Okay, we're good. All right, let's get through here, shall we? Let's talk to more uh, first civilization. What is a fact? Is it fixed? Immutable? Certain in its existence? And only awaiting discovery? Or might it be changed? Here we learned the answer, and thought that it might save us. They were used to command, to control, to own. But we soon discovered another use. When enough sat in thrall and were told to believe, their thoughts took on form. What was imagined became real. If a hundred minds could wish away a wall or create a tree, what might a thousand do? Ten thousand more? Might we change the consensus and will the threat away? We resolved to send one into the sky where it might illuminate us all. Once placed, a sentence would be uttered. Make us safe. In this way, we would change the consensus. We would save the world. But it never came to be. We sent a dozen of them skyward, but there was no way to maintain control, to direct the beam to enthrall the world, to speak the words. Though this was strange and dangerous, what we tried next was worse. All right, Juno. I see you. Climbing on a- oh, gosh dang it. <laughs> Are you serious? Okay, so this part might be just a little bit short, probably about like 40 minutes, because I got to go to work in about an hour, so yeah. <laughs> so you're welcome, guys. All right, let's keep climbing up. There we go. This way. More talking. Our first instinct was to travel back to change the past, but we could not find a way. But forward, we could look forward. And so here we sought to see beyond ourselves and know what was to come. First we watched to learn if our work would succeed, but the answer was always the same. So we moved on to other things, but she remained the one you call Minerva. 
In time, she too stopped looking, and instead began to speak. She called out across time, in the hopes that you might be saved. She hid messages where none might find them, save for you and those within this place. Fascinating. I'm tired of it. The cryptic warnings, the threats. Just tell us what you want! But they are. We saw the Nephilim there. We seemed like grasshoppers in our own eyes, and we looked the same to them. Imagine trying to explain all this to a two-year-old, to a grasshopper. When they said the will of the gods was unknowable, they meant it. Literally. I killed her, you know. I killed Lucy. No! I saw what she was. What would happen if I let her live? I could have stopped myself. I mean, there was a force there. But I didn't have to. I chose to. Desmond. Lucy was going to betray us and take the apple back to Abstergo. I saw the satellite launched. I saw them turn it on, and then... It failed. Whatever's on the other side of that door, it benefits Juno. We need to be careful. Oh, man. Yeah, I felt bad killing Lucy, but she was going to betray us. Because she was like a double agent. Working for Abstergo and about to take the apple for herself. <sighs> Dang. I was just like... I was really sad about killing her, but until I knew, like, she was a double agent, then I understood. Understood completely. So, yeah. So I didn't feel as bad as I did before. So, <laughs> we're good now. Okay, I think there's one more talk with uh, Juno. And then we will be good to go. Going back to Connor. Or not. Never mind. Looks like we're just going to go back to Connor. Jumping down. Nice. I guess we can talk to everyone since we're here, you know. Hey, Dad. Son. I, uh, I owe you an apology. I, I shouldn't have lashed out like that. You have to understand, I've never been very good at this. Never mind that we live rather extraordinary lives. Yeah, I kind of liked my ordinary one. You can't escape who you are, Desmond. So I've noticed. Look, it's silly for us to go back and forth like this. I admit, I did a shitty job raising you. I apologize, I'm sorry. But it's important you understand it didn't come from a bad place. You're my son. I love you. I guess I was so busy trying to make sure nothing bad happened, I didn't consider the consequences. Truce. Yes, truce. All right. Kind of just wanted to talk to my dad because he hit me, you know. But let's talk to Sean, too. See what else he has to say real quick. And then Rebecca. Ah, Desmond, there you are. Can I ask a favor? Maybe. When this is all over, I'd like to try turning the dial back on the Animus. Like, all the way back. To the time of the first civilization. You think it would work? There was no real loss of fidelity when you visited Altair. Then again, that was about a thousand years ago, and I'm looking at going back at least 70,000 more. Sure, I'd be up for it. Be interesting to see what things were like back then. Excellent. I think it would prove most enlightening. Yeah, yeah. All right. Now let's talk to Rebecca. And then we will be all good to go, everyone. And back to Connor we go. Here we go. I know everyone thinks I'm being silly, but I can't shake the feeling we're being watched. We are being watched. By Juno. 
or some version of her. Do you think it's a recording? Or is she a ghost? Or something else? Is she talking to us the way Minerva talked to Ezio? No clue. I mean, who knows what else they were working on down here? There's still so many rooms we don't have access to. But do you think she's like literally down here, waiting somewhere, still alive? Still alive? That's mental. That I mean, she'd be at least 75, 80,000 years old? No, oh, powerful, yeah, but not that powerful. They came down here looking for a way to survive. Maybe they found one. Maybe they did. Alright guys, here we go. It's Animus time. Good luck, Desmond. These are troubled times. The already uneasy alliance between the Crown and its subjects frays. And behind them both the Templars plot. Pulling strings and moving pieces. History dictates they seek order through control. But how will they affect it here? Who supports them? And what conspiracies have they already spun? All these things I must determine. For only by knowing my enemy can I hope to stop them. Kana! Spare a moment. Of course. Have a look. What is it? Xing Bao, or rope dart, if you prefer. One of the many plans given to us by Xiao Yun to. <sighs> Sorry. We'll have to work on this. Someone's at the front door. Who is it? My brother! Ganondogo. Yes, my friend. What brings you here? Is the village all right? For now. What do you mean? What has happened? Men came, claiming we had to leave. They said that the land was being sold, and that the Confederacy had consented. We sent an envoy, but they would not listen. You must refuse! We cannot oppose the Sachem, but you're right as well. We cannot give up our home. Do you have a name? Do you know who is responsible? He is called William Johnson. Where is Johnson now? In Boston, making preparations for the sale. Sale? This is theft! Connor, take care. These men are powerful. What would you have me do? I made a promise to my people. If you insist upon this course of action, seek out Sam Adams in Boston. He'll be able to help. What have you done? When my people go to war, a hatchet is buried into a post to signify its start. When the threat is ended, the hatchet is removed. Uh, you could have used a tree. <laughs> oh, man. All right, guys. Guess what time it is. All right, let's see how far it is, actually. I want to see. Uh, let's see, all the way over here, it seems. Yeah, all the way in Boston. That is pretty dang far, so let's fast travel, shall we? Connor, you're beautiful. You're so grown up, too, I love it. He has one of the better suits in Assassin's Creed as well. All right, I see the haystack. Here we go. Nice. All right, now we're good to go to the main mission. So now we got a fast travel point in Boston. So whenever we travel here, we will use that exact point. Surely you can understand my reluctance to kick the horn. Here we go. The Tories thing, no matter what we do, might as well make it on Johnson's trail. Ah, Connor. Hello again. What brings you to Boston? You. Would you excuse us, fellows? Thank you. That conversation was about to turn unpleasant. Now, 
What can I do for you? I was hoping you could help me locate William Johnson. Of course. I'm headed to a meeting with some men who should be able to help. Why don't you come along? Well, it's good to see the people finally taking a stand against injustice. Says the man who owns a slave. <laughs> Ooh, sorry? I practice what I preach, my friend. She's not a slave, but a freed woman. At least on paper. Men's minds are not so easily turned. It's a tragedy that for all our progress, still we cling to such barbarism. Then speak out against it. We must focus first on defending our rights. When this is done, we'll have the luxury of addressing these other matters. Sounds good. Sam Adams. You speak as though your condition is equal to that of the slaves. It is not. Tell that to my neighbor who was compelled to quarter British troops, or to my friend whose store was closed because he displeased the crown. The people here are no freer than Surrey. Hey! It's my home, no matter what you thieves called taxmen say! The gums in Parliament who want to take my property, you tell them to sail across the pond and take it themselves! It's not open for discussion now. Open this door or these men will break it down! Ah! The bollocks! We're coming in! Ah! Oh. I trust the mounting evidence is proof enough, Connor. Continue on. I shall meet you at our destination. Oh yeah, my first guy to join the Brotherhood. Here we go. Let's get it! Uh! Got, we got all the new weapons now, too? Oh, baby! Get off me! The combat, the combat's just so fluent in this one. Really is. Justice for once. I dare the governor to send more. You all right? I'm fine. It's not my first dance. For all their teeth and claws, these little foxes, they fight like puppies. <laughs> Thank you, my friend. I'd buy you an ale, but uh, I'm expecting somewhere else. Done and done. All right. Join Sam Adams at the meeting. You got it. Let's call my horse real quick. Because it seems a little too far. Dang it, that really sucks that they took away petting the animals. I wanted to pet that pig, man. I'm really sad now. Why would they take that away? That's one of the awesome features in this game is petting the animals. Like the dogs and everything. Pretty sure you could have done that in Unity. Oh my goodness, they're blocking the path. Of course they are. <laughs> Don't know why my horse jumped right there, but okay. All right, Samuel Adams. I'm coming right to you. Ah, yes, here we go. How convenient. Connor, I'd like you to meet some like-minded friends. The owner of this fine establishment, William Molyneux, and the manager and chef of his newest venture, Stéphane Chaffaut. Ah, Connor and I just had a ball uh, with some red coats and forcing some tax men outside my home. The collectors grow bolder and more forceful. Something we must address, Samuel. Then let us raise a banner. Something to let the people know that they are not alone. The docks are an angry place of late. Protesters picketing the latest shipments of British tea. The eyes of the city are upon that stage. A Bostonian without his tea is a dangerous beast. William Johnson is smuggling the tea off the ships. One of his men tried to sell me this. A sample of what I refused, but it's from those ships. No mistaking the stamp. He's charging a king's ransom. Must be he's making a mint off those who buy it. Where is he now? I've never met the man. 
May I ask why you seek him, Connor? He intends to purchase the land upon which my village stands, without the consent of my people. No doubt the revenue from his little smuggling endeavor is financing the acquisition. A tax enforced on tea grants a boon to smugglers. I'll wager the same men who levy the taxes are selling the tea. A stage requires a spectacle, and I may know the play. All right, guys. Connor, give me just a. To oh. the docks and see to the destruction of the tea. If you should need us, return here. Yeah, I remember. I remember what to do. But hang on, just a sec, guys. I need to. Uh, uh oh. Hang on. The same music track keeps playing again. Pardon me. Oh, come on, mate. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Yikes. Alright, give me just a sec, guys. Alright, guys, that's much better. Oh, man, I remember this. Yo. This is, like, near the end of the game where I was chasing, uh... What's his name? <laughs> Charles Lee. Yeah, I remember. I remember everything. Oh boy. People see me. Alright, destroy the smuggled cargo stacks. I need to do that by basically... Um, getting dynamite, if I remember correctly. But where's the dynamite at? Or do I just set it on fire or something? Hang on. Can I just do that? Oh, here we go. Nice. Planting a random bomb that I don't even remember getting. And I'm going to this one. Hey, what's up, guys? You ready to fight? Let's go! Two of you are down. Huh? You want some? Come get it. No, you don't! Run. Sorry. But you're done now! Whew. Okay. Shouldn't have messed with me. Alright. Oh, crap. I just remembered. Gotta get that dynamite. Go, 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 go. Woo! Nice. Alright, got the dynamite. We're good. Dynamite, dynamite. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Actually, I don't think I need it after all. Or do I? Do I? I think I do. What's up, guys? You want to go? Come on. Sorry about it. Shouldn't have even tried. All right, come here, dynamite. I think I needed this dynamite, right? Pretty sure that I needed to carry it all the way over to the other side. Wish I could run a little bit quicker, but eh, it's whatever. Only less than 100 meters away. But there is no straightforward path, so... <laughs> That sucks. But I'm sure I'm going to be fine. You are now incognito. Alright, just the way I like it. Assassin loves being incognito. I have a feeling I'm going to get spotted right here. It's going to be over, guys. Get ready. Come on. Go, go, go. Is there a way out of the ship? I think there is. Hang on. Keep it going. If there was dynamite over here, I'm going to be so mad. <laughs> I swear. Alright, there's the people right there. Don't mind me, fellas. Just, uh, bringing this dynamite over. Gosh dang it, there was dynamite over here. Frick you! Ah! Oh, you're a good person. Sorry. Okay. Okay, I guess I didn't need dynamite after all. 
I'm just an idiot. I'm sure I cut edit it. I cut edit that. There we go. Done and done. Alright, what's next? Liberate district from Templar influence. You got it. Go, 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 baby. Oh, man, I love the running of Connor. It's just so fluid. What's up, guys? What do you think you're doing? Huh? You wanna go? Let's go. Woo! We got a lot of people. Oh, wow. They just, they hit me on the ground? Really? I don't like this angle. I don't like this angle. Hang on. All right, we're good. It's not showing like the red signs all of a sudden. It's weird. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Thank you. All right, you want some? No, you don't. I don't think so. Don't you freaking do that to me. Don't you freaking hit me either. Get out of here. Get out of here. Come on, come here. You want some? Take it. Woo. Sorry. And you're done. Nice. All right, guys. Liberate the district over here as well. All right. Let's call my horse real quick. Come here, horsey. Oh my gosh, these kids are annoying. These kids are annoying. Are you kidding me? Controller, I swear you are going to piss me off. Are you kidding? Alrighty then. You guys just want to go. Alrighty then, that's fine. Fine with me. Come on. What's up? What's up? Huh? Alright. Alrighty then. You had your fun. Sure you had your fun. Come here. Come here. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. Out of my life. Yo, they just keep coming at me, don't they? I gotta get rid of my uh, notoriety or whatever it's called. Tear down some posters. I remember this part, though. I believe this is like the T part. Dispose of the tax collectors. Okay, then. Here we go. Let's do it, then. Whoop, sorry about it. I'll dispose of all these tax collectors. Nice. All right. Let's just climb up here, shall we? What? Someone see me. Okay, then. One more district, I think, and then it's uh, tea time. Oh, you want to go? You want to freaking go? What the? Really? I'm sorry. You really shouldn't have done that, though. Ugh. What do you think you're doing? Oh, you want some too? Come on then. Oh, okay then. Let me just disarm you, shall we? You're not getting your weapon back ever again. What do you think you're doing, huh? You wanna go? Get on the ground. You don't even try. Excuse me, coming through. Whoops, over here. All right, I think we made it. I think we'll be good now. Good to go. <laughs> Jeez. Wait, is this thing moving? This guy's moving. Hang on. Let's go get him. And come here. Gotcha. Nice. All right, what's next? Oh, that's it. Nice. Mission complete. I'll take it, man. What the? Oh, you guys want to go? Come on, then. Come on, then. Ooh, how'd you like that? 
off the freaking wall. I'll take it, man. Alright, how far is this place? Oh, it's not too far at all. Nice. Looks like I was going the right way. Nice. Little pathway. And a port approach the fort. Oh boy. This is gonna be fun. Someone really spot me. Really? Yo, guys, just chill out. Chill out. No, no, no. If you want to fight me over here, come fight me over here. Okay. Come on. Come on. Oh, don't you shoot me. Just come fight me. Let's go. This music track's going in, fam. Come on. Come on. I'll take two at once. Three at once. All at once. Get off me! Get off me. Nope. Come on. Woo! There we go! Yeah! I'll take all of you! Ah. You're done! Ah, oh, crap. I meant to shoot him. I meant to shoot him. Woo! No, you don't. I'm sorry, sir. Are you on your horse? Oh no, ow, frick you. All right, uh, let's get this rope dart out. Sign rope dart. Wait, throw bait. I don't wanna throw bait. Ouch, you piece of crap. How dare you? Come on then. Get off me. Whew, jeez. And all that for just getting over here. Gosh. Stefan, what is wrong? Where is Sam Adams? Who cares? I've been robbed. Oh, I remember this. He's Where gonna are kill. You going? To get back what's rightfully mine. He's gonna kill everyone. Oh man, I remember this. Frick. Probably after this I'm gonna have to end it though, guys. Because it's 2.36 p.m. And I gotta get to work. Oh, By three! I, will match your safety, I did it for you, buddy. Let's keep going. Just gonna keep defending him. I think that means he's not happy, guys. <laughs> oh my goodness. Nope, he ain't happy at all, and he's gonna kill every freaking body on the streets. Oh, with people with him, yep. That's right, I remember this. So many more people gather around. Alright, he's going this way, and he's gonna take out these guards right here. Ready for this, guys? Here we go. We are not English. We are not the king's men. We are free. Let's get it. Down you go. Where you think you're going? Get out of here. All right. Nice. Stephon, please stop and listen to me. I've listened for long enough. They come into my home and take my things. I will get my revenge. The man responsible for this will pay. His friends will pay. Voilà trop longtemps que je subis ces affronts. Ils vont goûter de mon courroux. Oh man. Yeah, he ain't happy at all. Come on. Just punching their lights out. I love it. Let's uh switch to uh, the hatchet again. Oh boy, here we go. Come on. Woo! Two and one. Three and four. You're welcome. 
Oh my goodness. I think we're halfway done. Yep, here we go again. Come on. See ya. There is a way to fight injustice, but this is not it. Just gonna get a little stuff while I'm at it. Why not? All right. He's going through here, and then there's two more guards over here around the corner. Yep. What's up, guards? How's it going? This guy is going to try to kill you, so I'm going to do it myself. Um. There we go. Nice. I'm not even going to give him the chance to fight. <laughs> Destroyed? You stupid man. I suppose you want me to tell Johnson his tea just spontaneously combusted. Nonsense. Someone's responsible for this, and you will find out who. And if you can't, I'll gut you and find a smarter mongrel who can. What do we do? Create a window. Here we go. Alright, hold recruit wheel. Yes, baby. Oh, come on! Really? Controller, you are gonna. All right, here we go. And assassinate. Go get him. Go get him. Oh, Incoming. Oh. <laughs> Why? You have no right to rob people blind, by decree of the British Parliament or not. British Parliament? I worked for William Johnson. Johnson? And his suffering cleanly. Please. So long. And farewell. Screw William Johnson. The people seem to have an ear for you. What are the things you lost? The people listen to me only because I spoke the truth loud enough, which is worth 1,000 times the content of my footlocker. The English, they can keep my things. You did well tonight. I said I'd buy you an ale when you first helped me. In place of drink, I offer you my allegiance, for what it's worth. Your aid is welcome, and I am grateful. Now, I need to find Sam Adams. Nice! The angry chef! Oh, are you kidding? Really? No! No, 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 no. Why does that happen? That makes no sense why that happens. No sense at all. Come on, then. Come on, then. Get over there. Sorry, did you want to come at me? I don't think so. Get off. Run. Try again. Woo. Oh, you shouldn't have stepped in my circle. Come on, then. See ya. Woo. All right, guys. Well, that being said, I'm going to... Really? You want to come at me? Alrighty then. Whoa! Hey! That's not allowed. No guns to a freaking man fight! Alright guys, well that being said, I'm gonna end this video right here, so thank you all so much for watching. You guys are the best and only Assassination family on YouTube, going big and growing strong. I love you all, and if you're new, be sure to subscribe to the Assassination family today. I'd be honored to have you. And as always, I will see all of you guys in the next video. Assassin4259, out.